Alrighty, this is going to be a very quick video explaining that yes, you can use SIM hub wirelessly to an iPad or Android unit. Uh, even an old iPhone works fine with both PC and PS5. I did take some quick troubleshooting, but thanks to a couple other YouTube videos, I was able to kind of fill in the blanks. I'll show you real quick. This is the rig I would usually keep at the desk but with the playstation here i can you can see it all works fine and that would allow you to then get rid of the heads up display i've got all my pc components from over there wirelessly running right here so I can keep an eye on it everything works just fine it did take a bit to do whoa let's go ahead and stop that and if we come over here you just have to go onto your network settings of the PlayStation get the IP address and then if you come right here you can come up to the top type in check firewall status go advanced settings go over here where it says inbound outbound we'll refresh that click on it then you can hit new rule and here you just got to go port next UDP put in the two numbers that I'll put in the description that is for any PlayStation working with SIM hub. If you come over here to SIM hub and then you'll see it's right here. It's these two numbers for the ports there, both starting with three, three, you separate them with a comma. And of course for myself, I thought I had the wrong version of SIM hub two. It's the unpaid, although I'm definitely paying for it after this experience, I'm just going to go ahead and set that up. You can just type in grand. And that'll come up and you just click on it and so you can see it even says the game is paused. But if you're like me, you might have an additional firewall protection like a vast. And with a vast, you just go over to the uh, firewall settings. And then down here, over where it says application rules in a vast, you would come down, you'd find sim hub. And then you would go add new, which is this rule I have down here. I'm not going to show because it has my IP address, but let's pretend this one right here was the SIM hub drop down. You just click the drop down and you click add new rule and you go and you add it in here as well. The reason being it doesn't work sometimes with just the windows firewall. Like for me, I had to troubleshoot a few times. I had to come in here and figure this part out for myself. Uh, but after that, I just closed down everything, restarted everything, and now it works fine. So I can roll my rig back and forth from here to here and do Rally 2.0, Drifting, Shitoko, all the good stuff online. Anyways, if you have any questions, definitely put them in the comments. I don't normally do a video like this, but I wanted to show people that it is definitely doable. Uh, you run into this issue where sometimes you just have to put it back down and then you s pull down on your finger, you hit that full screen button and then it will stay up, but it goes back to uh, standby sometimes. So it all works fine. You just have to uh, take about 20 minutes to troubleshoot and figure it out.